Well, I'm about to spread this liquid tar gel. I know you can't see it, and I can't turn it because the lid's not on, but it is Golden's Medium's Clear Liquid Tar Gel. Let's see if I can get a photo of it. Anyway, that's the product that I'm going to use. And screw it. Credit card handy. This is the polypropylene sheet that is clear. The paint has dried. And now I'm going to scoop up some of this product. It's very, very, very thick. And I'm going to spread it onto this propylene, polypropylene sheet. Pretty thin, actually. I suppose I could use a paintbrush, but I find that this credit card thing gets it about as thin as you could possibly get it, which is what I'm aiming to do. This will do when it dries clear, which will probably be either late, late, late this evening or tomorrow, almost 24 hours. It will create a thin plastic sheet that I can peel up and use glue or find some other use for that has this design on it. It's almost like a a, a skin. That's why it's called acrylic skin. In fact, when it dries on your hands, which I didn't have gloves on right now, it feels like the product new skin that you put over burns or wounds of some sort so it can heal. It's almost like a skin. And it's self-leveling, so the lines that I'm putting in with this credit card smearing um, probably won't matter very much. The object is to get it pretty much as evenly spread as I can and I think that's going to do it. So another video later and I will show you what it looks like.